Hello, this is RJ Dent in my library. Um, today we're going to be looking at um, uh, quite a controversial author in his time, uh, Hubert Selby Jr., uh, probably most famous for um, Last Exit to Brooklyn, uh, made into uh, a challenging film by um, Uli Edel, if I remember correctly, um, starring Jennifer Jason Lee and Burt Young, uh, who's... Um, anyway... Um, a very good book, with this one particular one introduced by Anthony Burgess, um, I'll say um, Brooklyn in the 50s, um, very deprived area, uh, a lot of people, a lot of suffering and this is the story of some of the people in that, um, in that area. Uh, the book was um, brought for prosecution when it first came out but uh, obviously its literary merit showed that it was a serious novel with a serious intent. A very good, very wonderful book. Uh, my own personal favourite is The Room. This is um, the follow on to, it's not a sequel but it's a totally separate standalone novel um, about a man who's incarcerated and he's thinking back over um, the reason he's been caught and his um, it be, he becomes uh, obsessed with revenge so the novel is really his thoughts on the types of revenge he would have on the people that incarcerated him and it's an incredibly powerful book it's not not a book to read if you if you've got a weak stomach it's a really strong powerful book but it's incredible even Selby Jr. himself said in an interview that he had reservations about the content of it but it's I mean to me that's what elevates it to a real work of art that it goes into territories that no other book you've ever read goes into it is phenomenal it was deeply powerful moving book um, and the next one is the demon um, again this is one of his troubled characters who um, does everything. He's self-destructive. This uh, this chap in this um, story, Harry, his name is. Uh, he's just goes on a, you know, very successful, but he sort of sabotages himself. A very very interesting story. Okay, that's the demon. Um, the next one is uh, Requiem for a Dream, made into an incredibly um, successful film. Um, yeah, there's. I would say after after um, the room and after Last Exit to Brooklyn, this one is is sort of equal to Last Exit to Brooklyn. This one in terms of its um, power and it's uh, it's entertaining as well. That's the thing about these novels that not only have they got a serious purpose, but they're also entertaining as well. Very entertaining, and they're not like reading anyone else. Okay, so that's Requiem for a Dream. Please watch the film if you get a chance. Well, it's very good. A uh, collection of um, short stories now. Song of the Silent Snow. Uh, Hubert Selby Jr., also a short story writer as well as a novelist. And these were stories that have been collected together. They've been published in various magazines over the years. And he collected them together. Uh, very good. Worth reading. And then this one, The, uh, the Willow Tree. Um the last novel that he wrote that I've got um, and um, incredibly good um, again troubled individual trying to make sense of the world they live in very powerful I wish I could say it was as powerful as the others uh, as as The Room or as um, Last Exit to Brooklyn it's not quite and it's still worth reading anyway and that is my collection of novels of um, Hubert Selby Jr.